Brooklyn. Hi, my name is Akila Clark and I'm with Pageant Live. I'm going to let the girls introduce themselves from USA National Miss. Reagan Watson from USA National Miss Federal City. And what is your title? USA um, Miss Federal City. Thank you. And what is your name? Sophia Overly, USA National Miss Junior Princess. Junior Princess. And what is your name? Tykeer Miller, USA National Miss DC Preteen. Nice. And did you have a platform during the pageant? My platform was, was Comfort Cases, which is a nonprofit organization that helps kids transfer to foster care without, with a backpack and essential items because no kid's suitcase should be a trash bag. Awesome. And how about you? Was this your first pageant? Yes. What was your favorite part of the pageant? To help others. You like to help others. Anything else? To stand up for bullies. Standing up for bullying. And speaking of bullying, can you talk about the Crown Care? Crown Care is like an anti-bullying um, um, company. Like it, it go, they go around the school teaching kids about kindness. About kindness. And did you participate in any Crown Cares activities? Yes, this summer I did a bake sale to raise money for Crown Cares. Nice. Well, thank you, ladies from USA National Miss DC. And we have Carmisha. Carmisha, can you please introduce yourself in your title? Sure. My name is Carmisha Tuck. I'm USA National Miss District of Columbia 2017. 2017. What a year. Can you tell us about the year with your crown? So, um, well, we started last March, so that means I'm giving my, my crown up in, um, in March, this coming March 2018. And so it's been a year of fun. We had a great time at, at Nationals um, in July. We were at in Boca Raton. But this year, the actual, the actual national pageant is in Disneyland. So they're going to have a great time. And USA National, national Miss is a pageant that is focused on positive pageantry. And so I think all girls need to be uplifted in some way, shape, or form. And that ties into my platform, helping everyone appreciate and reevaluate their true selves. Just being positive and knowing that you can do anything that you put your mind to, no matter how you look. You can do whatever you set for it. Nice. So what's next for you? So what's next for me, um, well of course I'm focusing on my career because I did age out of USA National Miss, but that doesn't stop me from working hard within my career and then maybe I'll do another pageant in a different pageantry system. But this is my first national pageant and it really taught me a lot. I have great bonds with some of the girls, me and Miss Maryland, um, me and Miss Alabama, a lot of us were still close, so that's great. Can you speak a little bit about your pageant directors? Oh yes, um, well our national pageant director, Miss Jackie Watson, is, is she's great. She's, like I said, is always about positive pageantry. She is one of the best pageant, national pageant directors that you could ever have. She get great gifts. I've seen them all. Even our state um, pageant queens get great gifts. And then my, uh, my um, local um, director, Miss Denise, she is great. She is um, an advocate for pageantry and she has us out here working and being, being queens. Nice. And to the young junior misses, misses, princesses, and queens um, that are coming into the pageant world, what recommendation or advice would you give to them? Always be confident. A lot of people don't have confidence in this. Once you, once you realize that what confidence really means and what it means to you, you'll be great with whatever you do. Well, thank you, Miss Carmisha.